For some reason, Pelosi makes a memory occur. We're uh, used to play in this little league. It was a South Des Moines little league, and uh, one day we was out there. I was out there. I don't know if I was just watching the game or playing. Probably in between games or waiting to play. And some kid was telling me that was playing that there was some ladies over there exposing themselves when they was out there. They was in the infield. The ladies were sitting in the bleachers. And uh, so I went over there. And yeah, there was, uh, there was a couple of ladies and it was like, there was like four or five. There was, there was like a whole group of people there that wasn't from Des Moines. They weren't even from Iowa. I think they was, I don't know where they was from. It was like a, it was like a freaking circus or something. I mean, it wasn't a circus. They weren't clowns. I mean, they were just normal people. It was like a bunch of people from different areas, from different states were there as a group for some unknown reason. For what they were there for, I don't know. Maybe they was traveling in a caravan or something. But there was ladies sitting up there exposing themselves to these little leaguers. I don't know. This is like, they were like nine or ten years old. And for some reason, it was like uh, a person like Pelosi was there with this group of women. But it was like, it was weird. It was like, they don't have, it ain't even there now. I don't even know if they even have a Southside Little League anymore. I don't know where it would be at. I don't know. They got a new park park area. It might be out there. A bunch of soccer fields, I think. But it ain't down where it used to be because somebody, some rich person, bought up the land, built apartments there, probably to cover up the fact that that place never existed. But uh, it just made me think if that was her and other women... Whether she was doing it, I don't know. I don't know. I. But uh, here they were. She was one of the ones in the, all these sexual harassment suits and all this stuff. And, it, you know, there they were exposing themselves to minors. I don't know. They was probably, what, 20 years old college students. Maybe just out of college. Maybe they were just graduated. I don't know. So, or maybe they were older than that. I don't know. It was weird. It's weird that, uh, I don't know why I keep, keep thinking that, but man, it was freaking weird. A lot of caravans like that came through Iowa. Just a mixed group of people would come through and they was all disagreeing. And then they'd try to get you in on the, their disagreement to side with one of them. I don't know, you know. It just it's just weird. They're just like a traveling band of weirdos come through here. I guess that's what happens when you live in a flyover state and they they either are too cheap to fly and they want to drive through and create a create chaos. I don't know. Anyway. It's really, that's that's what Pelosi every time I see hear her name it just brings up that and her name it's almost like a dy dyslexic way of saying policy, you know. I'm sure somebody or something or something the other couldn't differentiate between the word policy and Pelosi, you know. Maybe they were saying, Pe well, the policy. I don't know how they'd be saying it. Pelosi. Pelosi. It'd be some, probably some, anyway. Anyway. 